the storm of gaining be with you. What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube and Grand Star Legion? Storm Striker SX9 here with another Frosty Winter Bash, part of Storm Singularity. I am Storm Striker SX9, and the next game that I will be doing for Frosty Winter Bash, which is also part of Storm Singularity, is this will be a first time for. GSL Grand Star Legion as well. Hope you guys enjoy as it's been hyped up recently this past week along with others that I've done this past week. Um, And the games that I will be doing this fun game but actually um, it is Rise of the Tomb Raider. Yep, I'm bringing Tomb Raider to GSL. I may not be the only one doing Tomb Raider games in GSL, though, but I thought I would do Rise of the Tomb Raider for Frosty Winter Bash because, well, it actually does have you surviving in an area that is very frigid and cold and freezing and snowy. And you're literally hunting in the snow and surviving in the snow, climbing snowy cliffs and ice and everything in between. But yeah, also falling as well. But anyways, and avalanches too. But I thought this game would fit Frosty Winter Bash because of its frozen theme or icy theme or snowy theme about it. So I went ahead and Pick this one since I have this game on Epic as well as Steam. And I also have this for the Xbox One as well. I will be doing the PC version of the game through Epic Games. You can also find this game on the PS4 as well, I believe. Um, so yeah, this is of the... The newer Tomb Raider games, I believe Rise of the Tomb Raider is a prequel to the new Tomb Raider remake that was on the PS3 and the Xbox 360 before this one. And then you also got Shadow of the Tomb Raider, which is after this one. Um, which is technically a sequel to that first Tomb Raider game that was part of this trilogy. Anyways. um. So yeah, before we get started with the with the this game, I thought I would show you a little bit of history of the Tur Tomb Raider games. Yeah, so sit back, get your popcorn and drinks, and let me show you how we got here. So we got. Rise of the Tomb Raider, where you could get it on the PC, PS4, Xbox One, and Xbox 360. Forgot to mention it was also on Xbox 360. I don't know why it didn't have one for PS3. I don't know why. But then you come here, and this is where Tomb Raider first started. You have the first Tomb Raider, which was on the Sega Saturn, PlayStation 1, and PC. Then you got Tomb Raider 2, which was on the PlayStation 1 and PC. Then you got Tomb Raider 3, which was on the PS1 and the PC. Then you got Tomb Raider the, the Last Lost Revelation, which was on the PS1, PC, Dreamcast, and Macintosh. Then you have a PC-exclusive Tomb Raider game called 
Tomb Raider Lost Artifact. And you got a Game Boy Color Tomb Raider game. And you got another Tomb Raider Chronicles for PS1, Dreamcast, and PC. Then you got a Game Boy Advance Tomb Raider game, a PS2 Tomb Raider game, as well as on PC. Angel of Darkness, I think the other one was called. And then you got another Game Boy Advance version of Tomb Raider Legend, which was also on Xbox 360, PS2, Xbox, PC, GameCube, and Nintendo DS. Wow. But then you got more. You got Tomb Raider Anniversary for PlayStation 2, PC through Windows Live. Xbox 360 and Nintendo Wii. Then you also got Tomb Raider Underworld, which was on PlayStation 3, Nintendo Wii, Nintendo DS, PC through Windows Live, and of course, Xbox 360. Then you come to the very Tomb Raider game that I just got through talking about, which was on the Xbox 360, PS3, then again on the Xbox One and PS4 with the Definitive Edition. That one also was on PC as well. Then you have Shadow of the Tomb Raider, which was on the Xbox One and the PS4, and also PC as well. And that is it for that. But I do know that there is a remaster slash remake coming for the first three Tomb Raider games. It's coming next year. Can't wait for that. It's a total remake for those three first three games. Um. But yeah, let's go ahead and get to the game, shall we? All right, I think we talked enough. All right, so Tomb Raider Rise of the Tomb Raider is again a prequel to that first Tomb Raider game that was, that's a, technically a reboot. I think it's a reboot. It's from Crystal Dynamics, and yes, you're seeing that right. Square Enix as well. Um, I believe some of these also had Ubisoft on it as well. Anyways, um, let's get let's get going. Hope you guys enjoy. If you do, don't forget to click the like button, comment below, share with your friends, add to favorites, and click that subscribe button. Also, click the notification bell so know when we upload new videos. Let's get started, shall we? Forgot to mention, I will be playing this casually with game overs and deaths included. Probably some falling included as well. All right, let's go. There's Square Enix, Edeos, and Crystal Dynamics. All right, so. This is Rise of the Tomb Raider. As you can see, yes, I have played it before. You got expeditions, leaderboards, options, marketplace. You test your benchmark if you want to. Let's click the new game. Yes. Combat difficulty. Whoa. Combat difficulty. You have adventure, which adventure, focus on Laura's adventure. Combat will be easier. Combat has aim assistance enabled. Enemies have lower health and damage. Tomb Raider difficulty, a good balance of difficulty. Combat has aim assistance disabled. Enemies have normal health and damage. Seasoned Raider, challenging combat experience. Combat has aim assistance disabled. Health regeneration is only available outside of combat. Enemies have increased health and damage. Enemies have increased senses. Survivor, push your survival skills to the limit. Combat has aim assistance disabled. Health regeneration is disabled. Enemies have increased health and damage. Enemies have increased senses. More difficult enemies will be present. 
There are fewer resources and upgrades are more expensive. Extreme Survivor, the ultimate challenge. Combat has aim assistance disabled. Health regeneration is disabled. Enemies have increased health and damage. Enemies have increased senses. More difficult enemies will be present. There are fewer resources and upgrades are more expensive. The game only saves at campsites. That's technically hardcore mode. Good luck with that one. Extreme Survivors of Tomb Raider. Enjoy. I'm going to be doing adventure. Because I want to enjoy the story and have fun. Of course, we're still going to be running into a grizzly bear in this game. It doesn't matter what difficulty you pick. You're still going to run into one. And you're still going to fall in places. But yeah, let's go. What makes someone reach beyond the boundaries of human experience to face the unknown? As children, we question the world around us. We learn, we accept, and gradually we lose our capacity for wonder. But some do not. The explorers, the seekers of truth. It is these pioneers who define the future of mankind. The others, they're done. No amount of money is going to get them through those mountains. The lost city's up there, somewhere. That's going to be a hell of a climb. I'm not turning back. I know. You should stay here with them. Not a chance. Amazing, but the snow coming off those peaks is a bad sign. The trail leads up the mountain. We'll have a good view of the valley beyond from the summit. All right, let's take it easy here. This wind is crazy. We just need to keep moving. Hey. Even if we don't find anything up here, your dad would be proud. I know, but I have a good feeling about this. Oh, shit! Are you okay? Lost my footing. I'm fine. I have played this game before, by the way. But it's been a long time.
Lara. You're gonna give me a heart attack. Are you okay? Yeah. Come on. Looks like we gotta go through. turns we can hold up in this game. Do you really think we'll find this lost city? I know this is a long shot, but that old tracker said he saw ruins up in these mountains. Well, I guess if I was gonna hide a lost city, this might be the kind of godforsaken place that I'd do it. <sighs> I just hope Trinity hasn't beaten us to it. Storm's getting closer. We have a couple hours at most. Should be enough time. We're almost to the top. What do you think? We're close to something, Jonah. I can feel it. Just this last stretch to the top. All right. Let's see what's up there. But keep close to the wall. Okay. Looks like we climb from here. Keep your eyes open for falling ice. Right. You ready? I fell off. I fell off purpose. Feels pretty solid, but keep close to the wall. Okay. Looks like we climb from here. Keep your eyes open for falling ice. Right. You ready? <laughs> Feels pretty solid, but keep close to the wall. Okay. Looks like we climb from here. Keep your eyes open for falling ice. Right. <laughs> It'd be like rock climbing, or should I say ice climbing? Oh, no. Thank you. 
Finally! I got scared for a moment. We're going to fall a lot, guys. I'm sorry. Two weeks earlier. Oh my god, that was intense. It is the greatest cruelty of life that we're all too swiftly taken from it. We age, we decay, we die. But what do we leave behind? Bones? dust? What of the soul? Does it endure beyond our earthly existence? I believe it does. A truth lies at the heart of many myths and stories. A truth not of science, but something more profound. The key to unlocking everlasting life. I may have found the next piece to the puzzle, but... I'm not alone in this search. They're following me, watching my every step. I know them by name now. Trinity. An ancient, violent sect with designs on controlling the future of humanity. I must proceed carefully for the sake of my family. If anything were to ever happen to Lara or Anna, I could never forgive myself.
God! I'm so sorry! What are you doing here? I saw the gutter press was attacking you again. I thought you could use some company. No lies. Were you followed? Followed? Of course not. What's going on? I think I found the tomb. Oh, you can't be serious. The myth of the Prophet is real. Dad was right. Lara, your father was... unwell. No. He was close to a great discovery, tangible evidence of the immortal soul. I loved Richard. I would have married him if he'd asked. But he was a broken man. I don't want to see you end up like him. But Anna, he was right. It was everyone else who was wrong. The tomb's in Syria. Syria? Oh God, Laura, no. This is madness. Get your life sorted. Go home to the manor. You know I can't go back there. But this obsession ruined your father. I saw something. Something I... I can't explain. Now I understand what Dad was going through. It's all fairy tales. Nonsense. Don't go down this road. You know where it leads. It's the only thing that makes sense to me now. I'm going to find the Prophet's tomb. <laughs> Zone now. We better be sure about this. We're close. There should be an oasis in the canyon just ahead. You're wasting your time. There's nothing out here. Just keep driving, please. It's your money. Something isn't right. Oh, that's just local militia. You told someone, didn't you? They, they paid better than you! You both! Damn! Yeah. This room! Shit! They weren't supposed to shoot at us! Get us out of here! Shit! Shit! <sighs> no, no, no! That's not good. She's got a dislocated shoulder. Well, a fall like that would definitely do that. research about this probably got injured ribs said too. the prophet's tomb was hidden in the cliffs above one of the forgotten cities legend speaks of an oasis where the prophet was laid to rest Be 
incredible. Some kind of marker. I can't quite make out the translation, but this word. <gasps> Prophet! This is it. Dad was right. shown here performing healing miracles dad's notes mentioned this hmm. seems to be a map of some sort but i can't quite read the words to be a map of some sort, but I can't quite read the words. It's the Prophet, speaking with a foreign army. He convinced them to lay down their weapons. He led his followers through the desert, to the oasis. Still no sign of her. I don't think she survived the crash. All right, let's go. Constantine wants to breach the tomb before sundown. <sighs> They're after the tomb. I've got to find it before them. Hmm, my Greek is still a little rusty, but it's pointing to something hidden nearby. I'll mark down the locations. here. Order of Trinity pursued the Prophet and his people relentlessly until finally confronting them in their hidden oasis. A way through. Come 
a battle here, armed soldiers against religious pilgrims, the Order of Trinity. The prophet slain by the Order of Trinity. My son. The Order of Trinity has received word that the Prophet's followers are building a great tomb at an oasis outside Berea. But more upsetting, while we thought they were building the tomb for their Prophet, Trinity now believes he still lives. We have learned he is preaching his heresy among the local citizens, drawing more to him daily with his tales of how he conquered death. He is a liar and a heretic claiming miracles that come only from the divine. You swore he was dead. Have you failed us? Blasting their way in. This works.
Okay. <laughs> Finally. Charges! The Prophet's tomb. After all this time. And the artifact? Inside. God willing. Open it. Carefully. It could be extremely dangerous. Who the hell are you? You're a smart woman. I suspect you already know. Trinity. Where is the artifact? I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play games with me! You led us to this place. Look, it was empty when I got here. There was no body and definitely no artifact.
Jonah! Laura! There's so much I need to tell you, I don't... Did you find the Prophet's tomb? Yes, but I was followed. What? By who? They call themselves Trinity. They tried to kill me. What the hell is going on here? You're starting to scare me. The tomb was empty, but I think they were looking for the Divine Source. The, the artifact your father was after? There's more. I found this symbol in the tomb. I knew I'd seen it before. It was driving me insane. That's when it hit me. I saw it here, in one of Dad's books. Listen to this. The lost city of Katesh, said to have disappeared in Siberia sometime in the 12th century. Legend says that on the eve of the invasion by the Mongol horde, it sunk beneath a lake. What does this have to do with the Prophet's artifact? Same symbol. <laughs> Laura. <laughs> if the divine source is hidden in the ruins of Katesh, waiting to be found, then I have to go. To Siberia? Are you kidding me? Just think. If this thing could really unlock the secret of immortality, it would it would change everything. Sickness, suffering, death, gone. Are you listening to yourself? Jonah, we've been through so much together. You know there's more out there. This could be real. I don't care if it's real. I've lost too many friends. I don't want to lose you too. Dad never made the connection to Katash. He gave up everything for this. Including you. Stop blaming yourself for what happened. He made his own bed. I can't give up on him. Not now. It's all I have. No, it isn't. If you stayed still for five minutes, maybe you'd see that. Shit, Laura. What are we gonna do? I led them to it, Jonah. If the divine source is real, we've got to find it first. Siberia it is, then.
Jonah? Jonah, if you can hear me, go back. Please don't try to find me. I need to do this alone. work. Not enough to last the night. Uh, need to gather more. Dry enough to burn. I hope. Fresh kill. No meat, but... is here. We'll find it. And what of the remnant? They continue to resist us, but we'll have the situation in hand soon enough. Good. Trinity has faith in you. Trinity. Going to need a stronger bow. I wish this pain wasn't so familiar. Like looking an old enemy in the eye. It wants to take me down. It wants me to just lie down and die. But I won't. I can't. There's something here. There must be, or Trinity wouldn't be in this snowy hell. I just hope that Jonah is okay. That he found a way back. I just couldn't risk having him with me. Not again. The pain of losing him, that would be too much to bear. This is my path, and mine alone.
All right, guys, that'll do it for this video for Frosty Winter Bash, part of Storm Strength, Storm Storm Singularity with for Grand Star Legion. I am Storm Striker Six Nine. If you enjoyed this game, don't forget to leave a like button. Comment below, share with your friends, add the favorites, and click that subscribe button. And also click the notification bell to know when I upload new videos. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time.